Have you ever felt like there's something more to life, but you just can't put your finger on it? Like you're meant for something bigger, but you're not sure what it is? Well, what if I told you that your true purpose has been right in front of you all along? That's right. The secret to unlocking your life's meaning isn't hidden in some far-off place or behind a paywall. It's actually been with you this whole time, waiting for you to notice it. Now, I know what you're thinking. If it's been here all along, why haven't I seen it? That's a great question, and it's exactly what we're going to explore today. You see, in our modern world, we're often so busy rushing from one thing to the next that we forget to look at what's really important. We get caught up in the daily grind, chasing after things we think will make us happy, but somehow always feeling like something's missing. But here's the exciting part. There's an ancient wisdom that can help us break free from this cycle. It's a way of understanding the world and ourselves that goes back thousands of years. And the best part? It's all about something called reality shifting. Now don't worry if that sounds complicated. I promise it's simpler than you think. And by the end of this video, you'll have a whole new way of looking at your life and your purpose. Let's talk about this idea of reality shifting and how it connects to finding your true purpose. Think of it like this. Have you ever had a day where everything just seemed to go right? Where you felt like you were in the zone and the world was working with you instead of against you? That's a little taste of what reality shifting can do, but on a much bigger scale. This wisdom comes from ancient teachings that have been passed down through generations. These teachings tell us that the world around us isn't fixed or set in stone. Instead, it's more like a reflection of what's going on inside us. And when we learn to change what's inside, the world around us changes too. Now, I know that might sound a bit out there, but stick with me. Think about it like this. Have you ever noticed how when you're in a bad mood, everything seems to go wrong? And when you're feeling great, good things just seem to happen? That's not just coincidence. It's a small example of how our inner world affects our outer reality. The ancient wisdom we're talking about takes this idea and expands it. It says that if we can learn to truly understand ourselves and our place in the world, we can start to shape our reality in amazing ways. And the best part? This isn't about learning some complicated technique or buying expensive courses. It's about tapping into something that's already inside you, your true purpose. Now, Let's talk about why so many of us feel lost or unfulfilled in today's world. It's not your fault. Our modern way of living often pulls us away from what really matters. We're constantly bombarded with messages about what we should want, what success looks like, and how we should live our lives. But have you ever stopped to ask if those things really make you happy? Think about it. We're told that if we get the right job, make enough money, or buy the latest gadget, we'll finally be content. But how many times have you achieved something you thought would make you happy, only to find that the feeling doesn't last? It's like we're on a never-ending treadmill, always chasing after the next thing, but never quite feeling satisfied. This is where the traditional ways of finding purpose often fall short. They focus on external things, your career, your possessions, your status. But true purpose comes from something much deeper. It's not about what you do or what you have. 
It's about who you are at your core. The problem is, we're rarely taught how to look inward and discover who we really are. School teaches us facts and figures, but it doesn't teach us how to understand ourselves. Social media shows us carefully curated versions of other people's lives, making us feel like we're always falling short. And in our busy day-to-day -day lives, we often don't take the time to pause and ask ourselves what we truly want. This is where the ancient wisdom we're talking about becomes so powerful. It gives us tools to cut through all the noise and confusion of modern life. It helps us reconnect with our true selves and understand our place in the world. And when we do that, something amazing happens. We start to see our purpose unfolding before us. But here's the thing. This isn't about escaping from the world or giving up on your goals. It's about finding a deeper meaning in everything you do. It's about aligning your outer life with your inner truth. And when you do that, you'll find that success and happiness come much more naturally. So how do we start tapping into this ancient wisdom? How do we begin the journey of discovering our true purpose and shifting our reality? Well, that's exactly what we're going to explore next. We'll look at practical steps you can take, common challenges you might face, and the incredible benefits that await you on this path. Remember, this journey isn't about reaching some far-off destination. It's about waking up to the amazing potential that's been within you all along. Your true purpose isn't something you need to find. It's something you need to uncover. And as we continue, I'll show you exactly how to do that. Now you might be wondering, why should I listen to ancient wisdom? How can something so old be relevant to my life today? That's a great question, and the answer might surprise you. You see, while our world has changed a lot over the centuries, human nature hasn't we still struggle with the same basic questions. Who am I? Why am I here? What's my purpose? These ancient teachings have stood the test of time because they speak to something fundamental in all of us. They tap into truths that are as relevant today as they were thousands of years ago. And in many ways, they're even more important now in our fast-paced, often confusing modern world. Think about it like this. Imagine you're trying to navigate through a busy city. You could use the latest GPS technology, which might help you find the quickest route. But what if you had a map that not only showed you the streets, but also revealed hidden pathways, secret gardens, and amazing viewpoints you never knew existed? That's what this ancient wisdom is like. It doesn't just help you get through life. It shows you how to truly experience and appreciate it. These teachings come from various cultures and traditions around the world. From the mystical practices of ancient Egypt to the profound philosophies of India and China. From the wisdom of Native American elders to the insights of Greek philosophers. While they may use different words or symbols, they all point to the same basic truths about life, purpose, and the nature of reality. One of the key ideas in this ancient wisdom is that everything is connected. We're not separate from the world around us. We're an integral part of it. This means that when we change ourselves, we change our world. It's like dropping a pebble in a pond. The ripples spread out and affect everything around them. Another important concept is the idea of balance. These ancient teachings often talk about finding harmony between different aspects of life, between work and rest, between giving and receiving, between our inner world and our outer world. When we find this balance, 
life starts to flow more smoothly and we naturally align with our true purpose. But perhaps the most powerful idea in this ancient wisdom is that we have the ability to shape our own reality. This doesn't mean we can magically make anything happen just by wishing for it. It means that our thoughts, beliefs, and actions have a profound effect on the world around us. By understanding this, we can start to consciously create the life we want instead of just reacting to whatever comes our way. Now I know all of this might sound a bit abstract or philosophical, but I promise you, as we go on, I'll show you how to apply these ideas in very practical, down-to-earth ways. Because this isn't just about understanding some ancient concepts, it's about transforming your life and discovering your true purpose. So how does all this ancient wisdom connect to the idea of reality shifting? Well, it's all about understanding the relationship between our inner world and the world around us. Reality shifting isn't about magically changing the physical world with your mind. It's about changing your perception and your energy, which in turn changes how you interact with the world. Think of it like wearing a pair of colored glasses. If you put on red glasses, everything looks red. If you put on blue glasses, everything looks blue. Reality shifting is like learning to choose which glasses you wear. When you shift your inner reality, your thoughts, beliefs, and emotions, you're essentially changing the lenses through which you see the world. But it goes even deeper than that. According to this ancient wisdom, our thoughts and emotions aren't just passive reactions to the world around us. They're actually creative forces. Every thought you think, every emotion you feel, is like a seed you're planting in the garden of your life. Some of these seeds grow into beautiful flowers, while others might grow into weeds. Reality shifting is about becoming aware of what you're planting and learning to cultivate the garden of your life intentionally. Now this doesn't mean that external circumstances don't matter. Of course they do. But what this wisdom teaches us is that how we respond to those circumstances is far more important than the circumstances themselves. Two people can face the same situation and have completely different experiences simply because of their inner state. This is where the connection to finding your true purpose comes in. When you start to understand how your inner world shapes your outer reality, you begin to see that your purpose isn't something external you need to find. It's something that unfolds naturally as you align your inner self with the world around you. Think of it like this. Have you ever met someone who just seemed to radiate happiness and purpose? They might not have the most impressive job or the most money, but there's something about them that just feels right. That's what happens when someone is aligned with their true purpose. They're not fighting against the flow of life, they're moving with it. The amazing thing is, this state isn't reserved for a lucky few. It's available to all of us. The ancient wisdom we're exploring provides tools and insights to help us reach this state of alignment. And when we do, we naturally start to shift our reality in positive ways. But here's an important point. Reality shifting isn't about escaping from your problems or pretending everything is perfect. It's about seeing your life clearly, accepting what is, and then consciously choosing how you want to move forward. It's about taking responsibility for your life and recognizing the incredible power you have to shape your experience. As we go on, 
we'll explore specific techniques and practices that can help you start shifting your reality and aligning with your true purpose. But for now, I want you to start thinking about your life in a new way. Start noticing how your inner state affects your outer experiences. Pay attention to the thoughts and beliefs you're holding on to and ask yourself if they're really serving you. Remember, every moment is an opportunity to shift your reality. Every thought, every action, every choice is planting a seed in the garden of your life. By becoming aware of this process, you're taking the first step towards discovering your true purpose and creating the life you really want. Now that we've laid the groundwork, let's talk about how you can start applying these ideas in your own life. The journey of discovering your true purpose and shifting your reality begins with self-discovery. And the good news is, you can start right now, right where you are. The first step is to start paying attention, really paying attention. Not just to the world around you, but to your inner world as well. Notice your thoughts, your emotions, your reactions to different situations. Don't judge them or try to change them just yet. Simply observe. This practice of self-observation is like turning on a light in a dark room. At first, you might be surprised by what you see. You might notice patterns of thinking you weren't aware of before. You might realize that some of your beliefs about yourself and the world aren't really your own. They're things you've picked up from others over the years. As you continue this practice, you'll start to see the connection between your inner state and your outer experiences more clearly. You might notice that on days when you wake up feeling grateful, more good things seem to happen. Or that when you're worried about something, you tend to attract situations that confirm your fears. The next step is to start questioning your thoughts and beliefs. Ask yourself, is this really true? Where did this belief come from? How is it serving me? This doesn't mean you need to change everything about yourself. It's about becoming aware of the lens through which you're viewing the world and deciding if that lens is helping you or holding you back. Another powerful practice is to start connecting with your inner wisdom. We all have an inner voice, a kind of internal compass that can guide us towards our true purpose. But in our busy, noisy world, we often drown out this voice with constant distractions. Try setting aside some quiet time each day to just be with yourself. This could be through meditation, journaling, or simply sitting quietly in nature. As you do this, start asking yourself some deeper questions. What truly matters to me? What makes me feel alive and excited? If I could do anything without worrying about money or what others think, what would it be? Now don't worry if you don't get clear answers right away. This is a process and it takes time. The important thing is to start the conversation with yourself. As you do, you'll begin to uncover clues about your true purpose. Remember, your purpose isn't necessarily about what you do for a living although it can be. It's about how you show up in the world. It's about the unique gifts and qualities you bring to every situation. Maybe your purpose is to spread kindness or to create beauty or to help others grow. These things can be expressed in any job or life situation. As you continue on this journey of self-discovery, you'll likely start to notice small shifts in your reality. You might find yourself attracting different kinds of people or opportunities. You might start to see challenges as growth opportunities rather than obstacles. 
This is the beginning of reality shifting, and it all starts with shifting your inner world. But here's an important point. This journey isn't about reaching some final destination where everything is perfect. It's about embracing the journey itself. Your purpose will unfold and evolve as you grow and change. The key is to stay open, curious, and willing to learn. In the next section, we'll dive deeper into the specific techniques of reality shifting. We'll explore how you can start actively shaping your experiences and aligning more fully with your true purpose. But for now, I encourage you to start with these first steps of self-discovery. Remember, every great journey begins with a single step. And you've already taken that step by being here and engaging with these ideas. Your true purpose is waiting to be discovered. It's been with you all along, hidden beneath the surface of your everyday thoughts and routines. By turning your attention inward and starting to question your assumptions about life, you're beginning to uncover it. Trust the process, stay open to new possibilities, and get ready for an amazing journey of self-discovery and personal growth. Let's dive deeper into this fascinating concept of reality shifting. Now, I know reality shifting might sound like something out of a science fiction movie, but it's actually much simpler and more practical than you might think. At its core, reality shifting is about changing the way you perceive and interact with the world around you. Think of it like this. Have you ever had a day where you woke up in a bad mood and everything seemed to go wrong? Maybe you spilled your coffee, got stuck in traffic, and had an argument with a coworker. Now, imagine the exact same day, but you woke up feeling great. That spilled coffee becomes a funny story. The traffic gives you time to listen to your favorite podcast, and the disagreement with your coworker turns into a productive discussion. Same events, but a completely different experience. That's a small example of reality shifting. It's not about changing the physical world through magic or wishful thinking. It's about changing your inner world, your thoughts, emotions, and beliefs, which in turn changes how you experience and respond to the outer world. Here's an everyday example to make this concept clearer. Let's say you're looking for a new job. If you approach your job search with the belief that there are no good jobs out there, or I'm not qualified for anything, you're likely to notice only the job postings that seem out of reach or unappealing. You might not even apply to some great opportunities because you've already decided you're not good enough. But what if you shifted your perspective? What if you approached your job search with the belief that the perfect opportunity is out there for me? Or, I have valuable skills to offer. Suddenly, you start noticing job postings that align with your skills. You approach interviews with confidence, which makes you more likely to impress potential employers. You're open to opportunities you might have overlooked before. This doesn't mean you'll magically get every job you apply for, but it does mean you're creating a reality where success is much more likely. You're opening yourself up to possibilities that your previous mindset might have closed off. Now here's where it gets really interesting. Reality shifting isn't just about changing your attitude. It's about understanding that your thoughts and beliefs actually help create your experiences. It's like you're constantly sending out signals to the universe and the universe responds by reflecting those signals back to you. If you're constantly thinking about what could go wrong, you're more likely to notice and experience negative events. If you're focused on possibilities and opportunities, you're more likely to notice and experience positive events. 
This doesn't mean bad things will never happen, but it does mean that you have much more control over your experience of life than you might have realized. Remember, this isn't about ignoring problems or pretending everything is perfect. It's about approaching life with a sense of empowerment and possibility rather than fear and limitation. It's about recognizing that while you can't control everything that happens to you, you can always control how you respond. As you start to practice reality shifting, you might be surprised at how your experiences start to change. You might find yourself having more lucky coincidences. You might notice opportunities you would have missed before. You might even find that your relationships improve as your new outlook affects how you interact with others. The best part? Anyone can do this. Reality shifting isn't some special talent that only a few people have. It's a skill that we can all learn and develop. And as you get better at it, you'll find it becomes easier to align with your true purpose and create the life you really want. Now that we've explored the concept of reality shifting, let's talk about how it connects to finding your true purpose. You might be wondering, what does changing my perspective have to do with discovering my life's purpose? Well, it turns out these two things are much more closely related than you might think. To understand this connection, let's use a simple metaphor. Imagine your life is like a river. Your true purpose is like the natural flow of that river, the direction it wants to go. Reality shifting is like learning to swim with the current instead of against it. When you're not aligned with your purpose, it's like you're trying to swim upstream. Everything feels hard, you're constantly struggling, and you don't seem to make much progress. But when you discover your true purpose and align with it, suddenly you're flowing with the current. Things start to feel easier. Opportunities seem to appear out of nowhere. And you make progress without as much effort. Here's the key. Your true purpose isn't something external that you need to find. It's already within you waiting to be uncovered. And the process of uncovering it is very similar to the process of reality shifting. Both involve looking inward, questioning your assumptions about yourself and the world, and choosing to see things from a new perspective. Think about it this way. Have you ever had a moment where you were doing something and time seemed to fly by? Where you felt completely in the zone energized and excited. Those moments are clues to your true purpose. They're times when you're naturally aligned with your inner flow. But here's the thing. Many of us have learned to ignore these clues. We've been taught to focus on what we should do rather than what feels right to us. We worry about what others will think or whether we'll be able to make money doing what we love. And in the process, we create a reality that keeps us stuck in jobs or situations that don't really fit us. This is where reality shifting comes in. By changing your beliefs about what's possible, you open yourself up to new opportunities. By focusing on what truly excites you rather than what you think you should do, you start to attract experiences that align with your true purpose. Let's look at an example to make this clearer. Say you've always loved art, but you became an accountant because it seemed like a safer career choice. You might have created a reality where you believe art is just a hobby, not a real career, or I'm not talented enough to make a living as an artist. These beliefs shape your reality. They keep you in a job that doesn't fulfill you, and they prevent you from exploring your true passion. But what if you shifted those beliefs? 
What if you started to believe there are many ways to build a career in art, or my unique artistic perspective has value? As you shift these beliefs, you might start noticing art-related opportunities you overlooked before. You might feel inspired to take an online course in graphic design or to start sharing your art on social media. You might meet someone at a party who needs an illustrator for their children's book. Gradually, you start creating a new reality that's aligned with your true purpose. This doesn't mean you have to quit your job and become a full-time artist overnight. Remember, reality shifting is a process, not a sudden magical change. But by aligning your inner reality, your thoughts and beliefs, with your true purpose, you start to shift your outer reality in that direction. The beautiful thing about this connection between purpose and reality is that it creates a positive feedback loop. As you align more with your purpose, you naturally shift your reality in positive ways. And as your reality shifts, it becomes easier to recognize and follow your true purpose. It's like a snowball rolling downhill, gathering momentum as it goes. So how do you start this process? It begins with getting curious about yourself. Start paying attention to what truly excites you, what makes you lose track of time. Notice the things you love to talk about, the activities that energize you rather than drain you. These are all clues to your true purpose. At the same time, start questioning the beliefs that might be holding you back. Are there things you've always wanted to try but told yourself you couldn't? Are there dreams you've put aside because they didn't seem practical? Allow yourself to reconsider these beliefs. Remember, in the realm of reality shifting, anything is possible. As you explore this connection between purpose and reality, be patient with yourself. This is a journey, not a destination. Your understanding of your purpose may evolve over time, and that's okay. The key is to stay open, curious, and willing to grow. Now that we understand the deep connection between finding our purpose and shifting our reality, let's talk about some practical steps you can take to start this journey. Remember, this isn't about finding some grand, unchanging purpose that will suddenly solve all your problems. It's about connecting with your inner wisdom and aligning your life with what truly matters to you. The first step is to create space for self-reflection. In our busy lives, we often don't take the time to check in with ourselves. We're so focused on doing that we forget about being. So start by setting aside some quiet time each day. This could be first thing in the morning, during your lunch break, or before you go to bed. Use this time to tune into yourself. During these moments of reflection, ask yourself some important questions. What activities make me lose track of time? What kind of work feels energizing rather than draining? If I didn't have to worry about money or what others think, what would I do with my life? What problems in the world do I feel drawn to solve? Write down your answers in a journal. Don't worry about getting it right. Just let your thoughts flow. Next, start paying attention to your emotions throughout the day. Our feelings are like signposts, pointing us towards or away from our true purpose. When do you feel most alive and excited? When do you feel drained or frustrated? These emotions are valuable clues. They're your inner wisdom communicating with you. Another powerful practice is to explore your values. What principles are most important to you? Is it creativity, helping others, adventure, learning, family? Understanding your core values can help you recognize opportunities that align with your true purpose. Now, 
Here's a step that might surprise you. Look at your challenges and setbacks. Often, our greatest struggles point towards our deepest purpose. For example, if you've overcome a health issue, you might feel called to help others with similar challenges. If you've struggled with loneliness, you might be drawn to create communities. Our wounds, when healed, often become our gifts to the world. It's also helpful to explore different activities and experiences. Try new things. Take classes in subjects that interest you. Volunteer for causes you care about. Pay attention to what resonates with you. Sometimes we discover our purpose by stumbling upon it in unexpected places. As you go through this process, start creating a vision of your ideal life. Not just your ideal job, but your ideal way of being in the world. How do you want to feel each day? What kind of impact do you want to have? What kind of relationships do you want? This vision can serve as a North Star, guiding you towards your true purpose. Remember, your purpose doesn't have to be something huge or world-changing. It might be as simple as bringing more kindness into your daily interactions or creating beauty through your hobbies. The key is that it feels authentic and meaningful to you. Now, here's where reality shifting comes into play. As you start to uncover clues about your purpose, you might notice limiting beliefs popping up. Thoughts like, I'm not good enough, or it's too late to change, or I can't make money doing what I love. This is normal. These beliefs are part of the reality you've been living in. This is your opportunity to start shifting your reality. When you notice these limiting beliefs, question them. Are they really true? Where did they come from? How would your life be different if you didn't believe them? Then consciously choose new beliefs that support your emerging sense of purpose. For example, if you believe it's too late to change careers, you might shift that to it's never too late to follow my passion. If you think I'm not creative enough, you could shift to I have unique gifts to offer the world. As you practice these new beliefs, you'll start to notice your reality shifting to reflect them. It's important to take action, even small steps, towards your emerging sense of purpose. If you feel drawn to writing, start a blog or join a writing group. If you're interested in environmental issues, volunteer for a local conservation project. These actions not only help you explore your purpose, but they also send a powerful message to yourself and the universe that you're serious about this journey. Remember, discovering your purpose is not a one-time event, but an ongoing process. It's okay if your sense of purpose evolves over time. The key is to stay connected with your inner wisdom and to keep aligning your outer life with your inner truth. As you take these steps, be patient and kind with yourself. This journey is not about reaching a destination, but about embracing the process of growth and self-discovery. Celebrate small victories, learn from setbacks, and keep moving forward. Your true purpose is waiting to be discovered, and you have the power to shift your reality to align with it. Trust yourself, stay curious, and enjoy the journey of uncovering the unique gifts you have to offer the world. Remember, the world needs your authentic self and your unique contributions. By following these steps and staying open to the process, you're not just changing your own life, you're making the world a better place. As you embark on this journey of discovering your true purpose and shifting your reality, it's important to be prepared for some common challenges you might face. Remember, any worthwhile journey has its obstacles. 
but understanding these challenges can help you navigate them more easily. One of the most common challenges people face is self-doubt. As you start to explore your true purpose, you might find yourself questioning whether you're on the right path. Thoughts like, what if I'm wrong? Or, who am I to think I can do this? might pop up. This is completely normal. Self-doubt is often a sign that you're stepping out of your comfort zone and into new territory. To overcome self-doubt, try this. Instead of pushing these thoughts away, acknowledge them. Thank your mind for trying to protect you. But remind yourself that growth always involves some uncertainty. Then, focus on taking small, consistent steps forward. Each step builds your confidence and proves to yourself that you can do this. Another challenge you might face is fear of change. Even if we're not happy with our current situation, the idea of changing can be scary. We often prefer the discomfort we know to the unknown. This fear can keep us stuck, preventing us from fully embracing our true purpose. To address this fear, try breaking down your journey into smaller, manageable steps. Instead of thinking about making a huge life change all at once, focus on one small action you can take today. Maybe it's researching a course related to your interests or having a conversation with someone in a field you're curious about. Small steps add up over time and make big changes feel less overwhelming. You might also encounter resistance from others. Friends, family, or colleagues might not understand your new direction. They might express concern or even try to discourage you. Remember, their reactions often come from their own fears or limiting beliefs, not from a true assessment of your potential. To handle this, surround yourself with supportive people who encourage your growth. This might mean joining groups or communities of like-minded individuals who are on similar journeys. At the same time, set gentle boundaries with those who are less supportive. You don't need to convince everyone. Focus on staying true to yourself. Another common challenge is impatience. In our fast-paced world, we often expect instant results. But discovering your true purpose and shifting your reality is a process that takes time. You might feel frustrated if things don't change as quickly as you'd like. To overcome impatience, practice celebrating small wins. Notice and appreciate the little signs of progress. A new insight, a moment of clarity, a small step taken. Keep a journal of these victories to remind yourself how far you've come. Remember, every big change starts with small shifts. You might also face the challenge of conflicting desires. Part of you might want to follow your true purpose, while another part wants to stick with what's safe and familiar. This inner conflict can be confusing and sometimes paralyzing. To address this, try having a conversation with these different parts of yourself. Acknowledge that both parts have valid concerns. Then look for ways to honor both, perhaps by taking small steps towards your purpose while maintaining some stability in other areas of your life. Remember, it's not always an either-or choice. Often we can find creative ways to balance different needs. Lastly, you might encounter what's often called the dark night of the soul, a period of deep questioning or disillusionment. As you let go of old beliefs and ways of being, you might go through a phase where you feel lost or uncertain about everything. Remember, this is a natural part of the journey. It's like cleaning out a cluttered room. Things often look messier before they get better. During these times, be extra gentle with yourself. Reach out for support from trusted friends or professionals. 
Keep reminding yourself that this phase will pass, and on the other side is greater clarity and alignment with your true self. As you face these challenges, remember that they're not signs that you're doing something wrong. They're signs that you're growing, evolving, and moving closer to your true purpose. Each challenge you overcome makes you stronger and more aligned with your authentic self. Now let's talk about the incredible benefits that await you as you discover your true purpose and align your reality with it. Living with purpose isn't just about feeling good. It can transform every aspect of your life in profound ways. First and foremost, living with purpose brings a deep sense of fulfillment. When you're aligned with your true purpose, you'll find that your days are infused with meaning. Even mundane tasks can take on new significance when you understand how they connect to your larger purpose. You'll wake up each morning with a sense of excitement about what the day might bring. This sense of purpose also brings increased energy and motivation. Have you ever noticed how you can work on something you love for hours without feeling tired, while tasks you dislike seem to drain your energy quickly? When you're living your purpose, you'll find you have more energy for everything you do. It's like you've tapped into an inner wellspring of vitality. Living with purpose also improves your resilience. When you're clear about what truly matters to you, it's easier to bounce back from setbacks. Challenges become opportunities for growth rather than insurmountable obstacles. You'll find yourself better able to navigate life's ups and downs with grace and determination. Another beautiful benefit is improved relationships. When you're aligned with your purpose, you show up in the world as your authentic self. This authenticity attracts people who resonate with the real you. You'll likely find that your relationships become deeper and more meaningful. You might also inspire others to pursue their own purpose, creating a ripple effect of positive change. Living with purpose can also lead to improved health and well-being. Studies have shown that people who feel their lives have meaning experience less stress, better sleep, and even stronger immune systems. When you're fulfilled on a deeper level, you're less likely to seek satisfaction through unhealthy habits. Financially, aligning with your purpose can open up new opportunities. When you're doing work that truly excites you, you're more likely to excel at it. This excellence often leads to greater success and abundance. Even if your purpose isn't directly related to your career, the energy and positivity you bring to your work can lead to new opportunities and advancements. One of the most profound benefits is a greater sense of connection to yourself, to others, and to the world around you. Living with purpose often involves recognizing how your unique gifts can contribute to something larger than yourself. This can bring a sense of belonging and interconnectedness that's deeply fulfilling. You'll also likely experience more flow in your life. Flow is that state where you're so engrossed in what you're doing that time seems to disappear. When you're aligned with your purpose, you'll find yourself in this state more often. Life starts to feel like it's unfolding naturally, with synchronicities and opportunities appearing just when you need them. Lastly, living with purpose brings a sense of peace and contentment. Even when life is challenging, there's an underlying sense that you're on the right path you'll worry less about what others think and feel more confident in your choices. This inner peace is perhaps the most valuable benefit of all. Remember, these benefits don't all appear overnight. 
They unfold gradually as you continue to align more deeply with your purpose. But even small shifts can bring noticeable improvements in your life. Each step you take towards living your purpose is a step towards a more fulfilling, joyful, and meaningful life. As we come to the end of our exploration, let's take a moment to reflect on the incredible journey we've discussed. We've delved into the ancient wisdom of reality shifting, uncovered the deep connection between our inner world and our outer experiences, and explored practical steps for discovering our true purpose. Remember, the journey of finding your purpose and shifting your reality is not a destination. It's an ongoing process of growth, discovery, and transformation. It's about waking up each day with a sense of meaning and excitement, knowing that you're aligned with your authentic self and contributing your unique gifts to the world. As you move forward from here, keep in mind that this journey is yours and yours alone. Your purpose is as unique as your fingerprint, and the way you shift your reality will be unique to you as well. Trust your inner wisdom. Be patient with yourself. And remember that every step forward, no matter how small, is progress. Don't be discouraged by challenges or setbacks. They're not obstacles but opportunities for growth and deeper understanding. Each challenge you overcome makes you stronger and more aligned with your true self. Stay curious and open to new possibilities. Your understanding of your purpose may evolve over time, and that's perfectly okay. Life is a journey of continuous learning and growth. Embrace the changes and see where they lead you. Remember to celebrate your progress along the way. Take time to acknowledge how far you've come, the insights you've gained, and the positive changes you've made. These celebrations will fuel your motivation and remind you of your inner strength. Most importantly, be kind to yourself throughout this journey. Treat yourself with the same compassion and understanding you would offer to a dear friend. You're doing something incredible. You're consciously shaping your reality and aligning with your true purpose. That takes courage, persistence, and self-love. As you go forward, know that you have everything you need within you to create a life of purpose and meaning. Your true purpose has been within you all along, waiting to be discovered. And you have the power to shift your reality to align with that purpose. So take that first step, or the next step, if you've already begun. Trust the process. Stay open to the possibilities. And watch as your life transforms in beautiful and unexpected ways. Remember, you're not just changing your own life. You're contributing to the positive evolution of our world. Your journey of purpose and reality shifting starts now. Embrace it with an open heart and a curious mind. The world is waiting for your unique gifts. It's time to let your true self shine.